The human brain is an amazing structure which oversees functions of the human body. Inside the brain are dense networks of millions of neurons, which exchange billions of messages. Between the neurons is a gap called the synapse. Information passes across a synapse through the release of different chemicals called neurotransmitters. They diffuse across the synapse to the receptor proteins embedded in the membrane of the receiving cell. When a blue colored neurotransmitter encounters a particular receptor, it is unable to bind because it is the wrong shape. When a green colored neurotransmitter encounters a compatible receptor, it fits like a key in the receptor and initiates activation, which is portrayed here by the receptor turning green. Near the receptor inside the cell is a G-protein complex composed of four parts, a beta subunit, a gamma subunit, an alpha subunit, and a molecule of GDP attached to the alpha subunit. This complex fits into the inside face of the receptor. After it binds, the GDP falls off and is replaced by a molecule of GTP. Then, the alpha subunit GTP complex comes off the receptor, and the beta and gamma subunits detach and drift away. The alpha subunit GTP complex passes over the nucleus, which is enclosed in its own membrane and contains the DNA for the cell. The complex diffuses through the jelly-like cytoplasm, which can be seen to contain a diverse assortment of messenger molecules. The alpha subunit GTP complex encounters an adenylate cyclase enzyme, which functions as a cellular factory. The factory is inactive until the alpha subunit GTP complex binds to it. The adenylate cyclase enzyme folds into an activated state. It is then able to take in molecules of ATP and convert them into molecules of cyclic AMP, releasing free phosphate. The cyclic AMP molecules migrate throughout the cell to mediate an array of cellular responses. Eventually, the GTP which is bound to the alpha subunit is broken down into GDP. The alpha subunit GDP complex falls off the adenylate cyclase enzyme. As a result, the factory changes shape back into an inactive state. The alpha subunit GDP diffuses through the cytoplasm until it encounters a set of beta-gamma subunits. At this point, the entire complex is recycled back to the inner surface of the cell membrane. The receptor returns to an inactive state, releasing the neurotransmitter from the exterior face of the cell.